of my favorite things to play. That's called Monkey Down. So we're going to start out right here on the fourth string on the second fret and we're going to jump up octaves which will bring you to the second string on the fourth fret. And we're going to slide up one fret and we're going to go back down and back up. Okay, but then we're going to play with it a little bit. So you're going to use both sides of your finger, right? You just practice that over and over until you get that part down. Okay, so this is the play on that. Okay. It's just a... Okay. Third fret, fifth fret, third fret, fifth fret. Going from the fourth to the third string. back down. Then just up. Open, fourth string, and then open, third string. through that whole progression twice. So if I slow down a little bit. Now we're done with that part. It's just sped up further. The next part we're going to do I call the gallop. And remember these are just different techniques that I used to use to warm up. And I used to do it all the time and then one day it just kind of became a song. So the next part is we're going to start on the fourth fret, I mean sorry, the fourth string on the second fret again. Just go up one fret at a time. Again. And here's a little play on it. Okay, a tempo.
lot of times when I'm going from one note to the next, I will let that open D or whatever string I'm on, let that open string kind of ring out, which I was doing a little bit there. See that between the two of them? Open. The next thing, and we do that twice, and then we're going to jump up one string to the third string and the second fret. Again, we're going to do octaves. Up one fret, up one fret, up one fret. And now we're going to kind of do like a bar chord which is my first and second strings at the same time. So the variation there is the, the first time I'm going through it, I'm hitting a single note on the octave. And the second time through, I'm doing it like a bar chord. Now we're going to go through the same progression, but we're going to kind of play with it a little bit. We're going to go up that other note, we're going to go up to the ninth fret, okay? do that twice, just like everything else. Okay, now this is a little bit of a change up, but not too bad. Okay, we're going to go to the third string, third fret. And we're going to come up one string and two frets. So the second string on the fifth fret. Like a bar chord almost. Up to the eighth fret. Down to the second fret. Up to the fifth. Third fret. Eight. Second, five. Then we're going to hit a low A, just an open A, which is your third string. On the next string, come up to the seventh fret. Okay.
to the same part again. Skip that. <laughs> After we do this, you're basically going to follow the same notes, but you're going to jump one octave. Third, eight, second, five, eight, third, eight, second, five, eight. Open A. See what I'm doing right there? You can do all kinds of cool stuff with that. finger back and forth like that. It's the whole secret to the whole thing and once you get it, it's a lot of fun and there's a lot of stuff you can do with it. show you a little closer exactly what I'm doing there. Alright. You can do two at the same time or just one. You can do it with all your different fingers too. There's really not much you can't do with it. I really enjoy it. Let's put it all together one last time. Get comfortable? Yep.
that's it.